Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are in, back in action. My name is Mary Keniston. I'm with Pool Action TV. And we are here at the Soaring Eagles, and we're waiting for the lag. I want to take just a second to apologize to uh, all the people that are watching. I just dropped the F-bomb uh, a few minutes ago, and I'm really sorry. Anyway, it looks like... Uh, it looks like Saming has won the lag, and now I will introduce my partner in the booth. Everybody knows her. She's been around the game for, even though she's not that old, she's been around for a very, very long time. She's my little sister. I want to introduce Laurie John Hassan. Hi, Mary. How are you doing? <laughs> Boy, what a treat to have you. I'm so glad you agreed to sit in with me. I'm so, gl I'm so honored, actually, to do the finals. Wow. What 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 great play <laughs> this week. Isn't it wonderful? I mean, you and I started around the same time. And, you know, remember everybody told us, oh, you know, the guys said, oh, women will never be allowed to play. Or, well, first of all, we weren't allowed to play. But they said we'd never be able to play. Right. And it's just so astonishing to see such a high level. I'll tell you, this Simon Chin breaks them. She's Balls. amazing. Balls, amazing. She breaks them as good as anybody I've ever seen male or female. And I'm looking for uh, some real stellar play. She struggled in the uh, in the semifinals. I watched. And, uh, but, uh, well, the majority, what, every match I think today has been hill-hill? A struggle. Hill. It has been a struggle. But, but it's been hill-hill. Yes. Everyone. <laughs> everyone. Yeah. What, a, what, a, what a great uh, treat for the fans. Yeah, for the exactly. Fans. The fans <laughs> love it. <laughs> no, I like it. So do I. All right, now we are one race to 11. It's an extended race. So it'll be a race to 11. As you know, it is alternate break, three point rule in effect, and three foul rule, in, three consecutive foul rule is in effect, yep. which is loss in game. I and like I think the, she's going uh, for the bank. Mm -hmm. I like having to have the, uh, no, she actually cut, cut the she uh, cut one ball. I like the uh, three point, you know, the three balls yes. past the, the head string yeah. after the break. I think that's a, a, a great rule, especially since it's worldwide. Very important yes. for the United States to start playing like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the three point, to explain the three point rule, basically it is for every ball pocketed, you receive a point. And, uh, for example, if you pocket one ball on the break, you receive a point, and then you need two balls to go down to the end of the table, past the head string. Correct. And uh, for, you get a point for every ball that passes the head string. So if you make three balls in the break, you don't have to worry about it. You Correct. two, then you need one to pass. Uh, and it's to prevent the soft break. Right, for all exactly. The, yeah, for you guys who are listening, it's, uh, we don't like the soft break anymore. I never did. I never did either. I have a word for that, but I can't say that on the air either. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, meanwhile, as we're jabbering. I know. I mean, just is just running out. Her pattern play is uh, when she's when she's on. Her pattern play is just phenomenal. I know a lot of people uh, have seen her play on last year's. Pool Action TV telecast of the Asian Day Culture Event Finals. Yes. And the two players that were in that finals are the two players that are in this final. So this is a rematch. Now, Kelly Fisher prevailed. Yes, she did. Last year in uh, the Asian Culture Day event in Las Vegas. That was in May. Mm -hmm. And uh, so Sai Ming, Sai Ming is looking to uh, avenge that loss. Exactly. And... Kelly's looking to win her second consecutive in a row. That's right. Soaring Eagle Masters, yes. No, oh, she didn't Tell win me. it last year. She, last year, Guy Young Kim won it. She was runner-up, but she oh, won she it the was. previous year. Previous year, okay. Right. Apologize. Yeah, well, I right. had it wrong, too, mm -hmm. uh, earlier in the week. And, of course, Kelly would like to beat Simon again. <laughs> Just, you know, for bragging rights and yes. also psychological value. Absolutely. When you get to this level, going back and forth, winning, you know, winning, whether it be on the hill or um, 
or just running over someone. You know, some of these girls sometimes at, at, at times just, you know, if in a race to nine, they might run, win nine to three. Mm-hmm. And uh, you know, you're pretty crushed. She overhit that ball a little bit. A little bit. A little bit. She's all right. Yeah, Sai Ming has, uh, has done that. She has run over nearly every one of her opponents until she got to the hot seat match. And uh, neither player played their speed. Uh, I think it was a lot of reasons. It was the first match of the day. And it's first blood for Samane. And notice how she hit that ball. Um, you know, for, for people watching, you always want to make sure you hit the nine ball. Firm. Yeah, you definitely don't definitely don't want to roll the nine ball. Right. You know, so she hit that, pulled the cue ball, you know. Uh, hit it with a nice firm with, stroke. Right. Let your stroke out. Exactly. Lori John and I came up on the old tough, you know, thick cloth. It was like a carpet. And, uh, you know, you didn't dare let anything roll off a piece of lint or, no. or a fur ball or <laughs> you know, a piece of chalk. I mean, you didn't roll anything. If you did and uh, you were a victim, you never did it again. Yeah. All right, right. Kelly to break. Kelly's such an interesting player. I I find her interesting, and and, why and, is that? and <clears throat> because I I don't ah uh, it's it's hard to explain. I, when when I watch her play, because of her speed and because you know she just she'll be off with position or something, and she comes back with the most incredible. <laughs> You know, safety, or or if she by accident hooks herself, which is very, you know, which is not often. Or she uncharacteristic. Last match, she missed several balls. Yeah. Uh, which I thought was very uncharacteristic. But yeah. Because of I feel, she needs to take a third stroke instead of two. You know, but. It's just that's that's what she has always pl- always played mm-hmm. like. And so. the nickname Quickfire. Yeah. She's got. Uh, such a good background coming from the snooker world you know a lot of people don't know it but Kelly is also a world snooker champion and so she knows how to play safe she knows how to cook, kick and she's just a phenomenal shot maker oh she and let she it get away that, yeah she was she trying the combination there? I don't know I, I, I was thinking that she was and then I think she missed it and you can't give Siming any air she will torture you. Yeah, definitely. I watched her play Donnie Mills, uh, top male player. I know. A couple of weeks ago, and uh, both it was a race to 21. It was even nine ball, and uh, it went down to the wire both times, and she did win. But uh, she played fabulous. I mean, so did he. And I mean, you know, they both played great. <laughs> At that point, there's and, uh, no there's no man or woman. You know, it just it's great play. It was just period. absolutely, and I don't think she missed three balls out of the forty so games they played. Actually, eighty games they played. Good for her. Yeah. And I don't think Donnie missed uh, more than three or four either. I mean, they both played fabulous. It was just the most unbelievable exhibition. One of the, I'll tell you what, it's one of the top ten matches I've ever watched in my life, and you know I've watched a million great players. So what is she going to do here? Going to pocket the ball, two ball, and and draw it off the nine ball? I think so. I think so. Uh, She's more intent on pocketing the ball because, like you said, she can draw back off the nine. And if she makes the nine... And the uh, three ball's in a decent position to where she can make that, the Mm -hmm. three ball. Yep. And the four's hanging in front of the side, so... You kind of wing at the nine ball there just a little bit, you yeah, know. Well, Who of knows? Course, you know, of course, you never know. <laughs> you might get a good kiss. Or as Kelly Oyama used to say, when she'd let go off on it, uh, smash the cash. When in doubt, smash the cash. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> if you're listening, Kelly, how you doing? You should be. I told, I talked to you the other day and told you to tune in. All right, she's got a. Thin slice on the uh, three, but she should be fine. Just make sure she doesn't. Okay, see, that's the right way to do it. Exactly. I was just don't worry about getting hooked behind the nine. And and you don't have to, again, for those watching, you don't have to roll. You never want to roll if you don't have to. If you can go up and down the table, 
that's something that I'm constantly reminding myself, you know, go up and down the table, hit mm-hmm. the ball. Yep. So that just, that shows that she is, uh, she just really knows how to think correctly, how to get on the correct side of the ball. So here she just rolled down to the end rail to just touch it, and that way she guarantees herself an angle. Correct. Instead of trusting, you know, trying to bounce it off the end rail and hoping to get a good shot. She'll just come up naturally for the seven, one rail. Out to the middle of the table. I love her stroke. She doesn't do anything crazy. She doesn't, she's she's just smooth. Um, and when she has to hit firm, she can. She can. You know, she she's definitely can, but she just hits, just watch how smooth she hits this ball. It's beautiful. And again, Each ball clicks in that back of the pocket. just enough angle to get her off the <laughs> exactly. rail. She's always on the correct side. Not always, but I mean, most of the time, mm-hmm. she's going to be on the correct side of the ball. Yep. Great players, you know, if they get a little bit out of line, eh, they get a little bit disgusted. But great players come with the shot. They they'll come with a little bit more difficult of a shot and then get out. You know, yep. they just they don't let it bother them. That's exactly right. A lot of times, other players might you know, people coming up, amateurs, they get so distraught that they you know missed it. Or messed up on position, they miss the shot. That's the way I there like my is. nine balls, and that's how straight I know I'm in stroke. <laughs> when I get straight in on my nines. All right, taking a 2 0 lead. And, and her break. And her break. Kelly's patiently waiting for another opportunity. She will get them, get them, especially since this is the alternate break format. Correct. And folks, those of you just turning in, we are at the WPBA Soaring Eagle Masters in Mount Pleasant, freezing Michigan. (laughs) (laughs) And we are the only... (laughs) <laughs> the only professional women's association that is out there that has been in existence since when? Since the mid seventies, you 70s. and I were very early members. We yep. weren't the original founding members. No, but uh, we. My first tournament was Madeline Whitlow's last. Wow. Okay, okay. so at Mike Gash's in uh, Elizabeth, New Jersey. Yep. So I believe that was seventy four, seventy five. So we've been. We've been at it Kicking a very a long, long time, time which know? is a great, which is a great thing. And we've seen the development of the sport, but Absolutely. you know, Lori John, myself, Jean Belukas, uh, some players that aren't on the tour anymore, like Gloria Walker. Uh, who else? Debbie Smith. Debbie Smith, yeah. Shout out to Debbie if she's listening. I know she's battling health problems, so I hope you stay strong. So here's an interesting. This is this is a a, a shot where you, you're gonna she and she's gonna go for it. She's gonna she's gonna pocket she the yeah. She's gonna pocket the one ball, draw the cue ball over to the left, and get probably perfect position on the two ball. Knowing signing, she's yeah. <laughs> there it is. Yep. <laughs> she's she's shot. just incredible. It's just, it's it's such, I love, again, I'm going to just compliment, so get used to it out there. I'm going to compliment her stroke a lot because I really like how smooth her stroke is. You I'm in love. You didn't, yeah. <laughs> Go, calm down there, Mary. I am. I'm in love with this woman. <laughs> I love her game. I just, I love watching how easy she strokes the ball and the cue ball came all the way to the left and back over to the right and she's, you know, she's got a, a nice shot. She's a little tricky here on, you know, on, on, she's looking, she's taking a little bit of time on how to get to the, uh, it, it, she's looking w- if the cue ball, I think, is where the cue ball is going to go on the line on the, uh, for the three ball. I think is she it, can force follow it. And miss the nine. Miss the nine. Torque yeah. the torque the course of the cue ball and go one rail up between the three and the eight. That's the way I think. That's yep, it. Just like oh, yeah. but she That's didn't. That's what she's. Uh, no, she, didn't. she had. She didn't have enough English. Maybe yeah, she managed to miss it going in, mm-hmm. but she hit it. 
That was a hard shot. You had to have you had to have a little, lot of inside English on that shot in order to torque the would you say torque the cue ball? Mm-hmm. <laughs> torque. You know, you do. You, yeah. you, and and hitting it high does that. Right. Change change the line. The, yeah. Yep. Now, it's possible that she could shoot a cross corner bank and keep her cue ball under the eight nine for the four that's hanging in front of the side. But I think she's going to uh, just play a safety. Yeah. yeah, just like that, and then bounce back and cover herself. Oh, yeah, it's leaking out though. She, she leaked out a little bit. It's okay. But you know what? What she doesn't want, what you definitely don't want to do, is do come up with a crazy shot when you're up two zero on Kelly Fisher. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you just right. you, you've got to play tight. You've got to play tight, and you can't let her get to the table and actually shoot a shot, if possible. I think Kelly's going to uh, just uh, try to separate the balls, put her behind the six. Yep. Oh, okay, different plan. Going to try to cover behind the eight and the nine. Well, she yep. left a combination. She got a little roll there because the the th- the three she could have left a shot. Yeah, yeah, she was lucky. So off angle combination. I think Samin shoots it. I've never seen. I, I, what I like about this lady's game is she is aggressive, and she's got the foul firepower to back it up. Yeah, yeah she's look. She's aiming it up. Here we go. What's nice is the three ball is going to track to the right. right. And she's going so to have position. Nice. Yeah. What a great shot. Yeah. What a great shot. See, it's not just about making a combination. It's about knowing where that ball is going to, where the, right, the where first, the first ball, ball is going to go. Gonna go. Yeah. Yep. Yep. And she picked that off perfectly and hit it at the perfect speed and got rewarded. I think this is the, that was the game winning shot. She's gonna come just one rail. Oh, don't hit it. Oh boy, she came really close <laughs> she to knows that. Too. She, <laughs> just, she just made an interesting face. <laughs> uh, she's yeah. like, ooh, got lucky there. Yeah, now she's all right. Now she's going to try to get shape on the six to allow her to shoot the eight in the lower right hand corner pocket. That's it. And she's just probably going to go one rail and favor the outside of the pocket. She's going to go one rail. And that's right. Just come into the shot just exactly. like that. And even though she hit that soft, she didn't roll it. And she had she control. controlled it. She completely controlled it. And she'll shoot the nine in the same pocket. Zero, Samin Chen. This is the key Look, shot right here. Absolutely. Look at how yep. the three ball moves to the right. Mm-hmm. Perfect. Yep. Well, Kelly's got her work cut out for her, but then she's no stranger from coming from behind. She did it earlier in the day in her first match, playing Allison Fisher. Allison had her 4-0, and she came back to win the match 9-6. to mm-hmm. I passed Kelly and Allison out in the hall, and I congratulated. Uh, I, told, I told Kelly that uh, uh, she was destined to win this tournament because of her comeback, and Allison looked at me and looked at Kelly and said she'd better. <laughs> Yeah, really. <laughs> after you lose, it, it, for some reason, after you lose to someone, you want them to win the Absolutely. tournament. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh boy, look at this shot. 
I mean, what a just great, a break. great opening shot. Kelly's, this is Kelly's specialty, these long straight in shots. She'll spear it. 100 and, uh, miles an hour yeah. and just, yeah. And she's, and now Kelly's game, love her game. Just totally different. Oh, just absolutely. A totally contrast in style. Oh, yeah. And uh, how do you like using the wonderful uh, Accurac by Outsville? Well, all I know is Chris Renfro always gives me a goodie bag. Uh-huh. Every Derby City with his chalks. And uh, uh, I like the white. I like the great white. Very and he gives good. me uh, the, Ac- the Accuracs. Well, and I love them. I'll tell you one thing. We appreciate their sponsorship and their, and you, you know, we're, we're using their rack for uh, this year. So, yep. We love you, Chris. Thank you. Thank you for your support. Absolutely. She, now she had a combination on the three, six, and she decided not to play it. She decided to play underneath. I'd, I'd rather play for position rather than playing for a combination. Right. Unless Uh-oh, combination. She undercut that ball. Oh, she sure did. And she jumped up a little bit. Mm-hmm. You know, that's one thing I did notice watching today. Uh, she jumped up. She, she's coming Several up times. on the ball. She's coming up on the ball a little bit. Yep, and she, and that, that little motion, shooting as fast as she does and shooting like she does, when she stays down and doesn't move. She's I mean, deadly. She's de- she, it's, yeah, she just doesn't miss. But w- she's coming up a little bit, and it's causing her to... Yeah, she missed she some did key that. Shots. She did that in her match with uh, we way way, and even though she won the match, it should not have been even as well as way played. Mm-hmm. It should not have been as close as uh, as it was. Kelly was very fortunate to win that match because she gave away several, I think three, very good opportunities to take charge of the match by missing easy shots like that. Absolutely. And with uh, this lady, you don't want to give this lady any air. No. I mean, she, she had a, a tough match uh, earlier today against Way. Neither one of them played very well. Um, but, uh, you know, like a true champion, when uh, she gets a sniff of the cheese, she rises to the occasion. Exactly. And uh, she plays awesome. In fact, that's the, the last the semifinal match today is the worst I've ever seen her play, and I've watched her play now about a dozen times. And the, you know, her her worst game is it's not too bad. Right, yeah, yeah. Her worst game is better than most <laughs> exactly. people's. Yeah, I know. Isn't so. that awful? <laughs> Even playing her worst game, I think I'd still have a problem. She's, she's pretty consistent. Yeah, I like to think so. I wouldn't, but... <laughs> if I was going to bet on me, I think I'd bet on her. <laughs> uh, meanwhile, look at that. Perfect. Just yep. perfect shape. And you re- let me tell you, this week I've noticed you have to really uh, hit the ball really well with a big stroke in order to draw that cue ball back. For some reason, the drawback was, you mean, if you, you were going to be punished if you didn't stroke through, like, like extra. It was, I don't know if it's a, if it, if it's, you know, it's just dry here right now, being, being so cold outside, too. Here's another one of those shots where she's going to, she's going to have to rub, off of yeah, the she's going to have to rub nine the nine. nine. Mm-hmm. Yep. And that's. Not where she wanted to be. She just, uh, she hit it a little bit thin. Well, she overran the six Mm -hmm. ball. And uh, if she would have gotten a little flatter on the six ball, she would have not had this problem. But, you know, this is no big deal. I have all the faith in the world. That, uh, Notice her pre like pre routine too. She's she she looks you know she strokes, strokes that she cue. looks yep. she looks she looks you know, and then when she's ready to shoot, she gets down. Mm-hmm. And this is not an easy shot. Even though it looks not too bad, it's really not an easy shot. Bingo! Right in the middle of the pocket. Zero. A great shot. No problem for Kelly. Remember earlier today she was down four nothing against Allison. What a great shot! The, the pause in the stroke. Just yeah, she pauses beautiful. on the backswing, just ever so slightly. Mm-hmm. Yep. 
Well, she's Kelly's been here before. Oh, yeah. She was down 4-0 against Allison. It's time to make her move. This is where you can't be comfortable. In, in, in the WPBA now, in the top women, you cannot be comfortable with a 4-0, 5-0, 6-0 Even with lead. alternate break. No. no. That's why Jennifer Breda was down today 6-1. to one. Wasn't that amazing? <laughs> I mean... So, just... I have never, to. I never have give to, up. I have to admit, I had written her off. I really had, mm-hmm. and uh, it was the most amazing comeback. One of the most amazing yep. comebacks I've ever seen. It was uh, never give up. Wow. I mean, she just kept coming, kept coming, kept coming, and then Jasmine started feeling the heat. Yep. And uh, that's what happens. You just make one little mistake. Yeah. You get paralyzed. Yep. Okay, here See we go. This break. Beautiful park the rock. Yep. The nine ball is going to set up. Up. Oh, got a little bump, but I think she's okay. See it. Nope. Yeah. Nate got in the game. Uh, she can make this eight ball though. She can make the combination. Mm-hmm. She's a very complete player. I've never seen anyone that does everything at such a high level. All the different facets of the game. Uh, True. Banks, she, combination, kick shots, safeties. Break shot. Right, you break shot. You just, <laughs> yeah. I mean, most guys would love to have her break. Exactly. And she's tiny. <laughs> I know. <laughs> That's what's really amazing. She's, she's tiny. Well, it was a good shot. Mm-hmm. That's the best you could do there. Yeah. You know, you just wanted to make the eight ball. Yeah, except the cue ball float or the one ball floated to the bottom rail but that's okay well sometimes you just have to accept what the table gives you yeah you know being of slight build uh, is not a problem I mean look at uh, Nick Varner I mean yeah. uh, I know a lot of people would have liked to have had his break too and uh, what does he weigh 100 pounds <laughs> sorry Nick <laughs> I didn't say it Nick <laughs> Lord. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm serious. I mean, he's he's a tiny man. Yeah. And uh, and then look at the Filipinos. I know. You know uh, look at Alex. Monster. Yeah. Monster break. Monster player. Yep. It's uh. And it's not so much power as timing on the break. Good break timing. What a beautiful shot. All right. Slow down. Mm-hmm. These tables this week, and, I, and I'm, I'm going to just have to say it's it possibly the weather. I mean, I'm, I'm serious because weather, you, you know how it affects. It, it just affects the, the, the way the balls roll and the, the, the cloth and everything. And, I mean, considering, you know, Simonis and Aramith balls have been, they go with us. <laughs> You know, and and, and uh, the on diamond, the diamond tables and the diamond table and the beautiful rails are so diamond live. Table. Exactly. Yeah. I mean, it, uh, I mean, there are sponsors, and and we thank them, and and they they play, con- you know, they're play consistent. But sometimes, man, it, lightning it's fast. lightning fast. In this <laughs> tournament, yeah. these th- 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 it has been playing lightning fast. Meanwhile, look at that beautiful that shot. Was a great three shot. rail shape to get on the floor, yep. and meanwhile, now she's in line. Exactly. I mean, uh, uh, simple draw back a little bit for the five in the corner, six in the side. I mean, it's just, uh, she's in line. Well, that's what, what a great champion does. They, they might get a little bit out of line, and then suddenly they get in line. Never, you know, never give up and never, it's okay that you get out of line sometimes. You know, you just have to come with that difficult shot, and that's what she's great at. Yep. And so many of the girls. Uh, she, you uh, just don't want the, the this one. You, I'm sorry to, to interrupt, but this one, you just do not want her to get <laughs> no. comfortably no, ahead. No, you want to you want to nail her to the chair. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to give her any air. And and I have to admit that uh, I'm very impressed with Way's game. I, I think the uh, Way plays very similar in style to Suning. And uh, I fully expected to see, I said earlier in the week, I thought they would be the two finalists in the event because they were both breaking the most consistently, breaking well most consistently. And uh, I know Weiwei's disappointed. 
to get so close. Yeah. I, and I know she really wanted to get in the finals. That I don't know if she's ever won a big tournament out of Asia. I think, no, not here. Yeah, and it would have been nice. Meanwhile, expanding her lead. What a great shot to find. And I'll tell you, you know, as far as being a spectator right now and sitting here enjoying this beautiful play, I do love 8-8 eight, eight matches. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> or no, I, in, this, in this instance, it would be 10-10. Hill-hill match. Meanwhile, it looks like while they're we were jabbering, they're taking a break, yep. so we will too. We'll be right back. Zero as the players take their break. Use this opportunity to run the restroom if you want so you don't miss any action. We could break out into a group, sing along, and sing sticks, come sail away if you'd like. I know you want to. President of the WPBA just said Gene Allen, the winner of the Q, has been notified. He is very happy to win the Q and wishes everybody a safe trip home and enjoy the rest of the match. Directly from the winner's mouth.
ready to get back to action here. Five and a half minutes to score. Kelly has the break on rack six. Okay, we're back. My name is Mary Keniston, for those of you who are just joining us. And I'm Lori John Hassan. My little sister. Oh, absolutely. I used to take Lori John to tournaments with me when she's 11 years old. My parents trusted you. Yes. <laughs> what a joy. <laughs> I know, I, I, I find that hard to believe. <laughs> but they did. I loved your parents. I loved your dad. Your dad you was don't the greatest. Even start. I'll start crying I know, I on want, the air. I know. I don't want you to get crying. Your dad was the best. All right. Well, Kelly's got. It's time to make a move. Kelly's got to come off the stall. She's down five zip. She took a break, which is good. Yep. I think it's a smart move. Well, that's what she Regroup. did with Allison and came back and beat her nine to two. From there. Okay. Good break. Even though that was a good break, wasn't her was not her strongest. No, definitely. I was watching the six ball, and uh, I think she might have been too because uh, she might have liked to have swung at that one ball, the one one eight one rail bank. But the six got in the way, making it triple tough. So I think she's going to play safe. I've seen some of the best safeties this week. My they're, goodness, they're awesome. Just incredible. One better than the next. And then the kick, you know, they kick back and kick safety or it, it's just, it's been amazing. Okay, she's going to try to get underneath get that underneath six. It, which is good. Beautiful shot. Oh, it's going to leak out. Up. Well, valiant effort. And Simon Chen, she's going to definitely shoot the one ball because she's got a natural, yeah. yeah, she's got a natural position, one, two rails. Or three rails, but <coughs> she's gonna have to make sure she doesn't get tangled up under the six. Sometimes when you shoot a shot like this, you you have to take your luck on being a little bit rewarded. <laughs> Never a doubt. And he's gonna hit the six full. No, nope, she and missed it. The, and, and made the She eight made ball. the eight. All right, good. Get that out of the and way. And position. And <laughs> position, yeah. And that, yeah, great position for the three. Yeah, she's, she's, you, you, you have to do that. You know, I mean, again, you're, you're not going to scratch because the eight ball was there. So just concentrate on making the one ball and take your chances, which This lady is the real deal. She sure is. And she's only going to get better. She may, you know, I, I, I always Already thought quit that I. Quit saying that, Mary. Well, I always thought I'd never <laughs> see a woman achieve the level of yeah. a man, uh, you know, the top men player, you know, the top men player in my lifetime. And she did. And, and that uh, was a rematch, I think, wasn't it? It was that a with rematch. Donnie, with Donnie Mills. That was yes. a rematch because people, you know, didn't believe, I don't know, you know, that they didn't believe that she could really do it twice in a row. Right. You know, and. And she still, you know, I think she'll still have trouble with the very, very elite of the men, but they're not stealing. They're definitely not stealing. No, and she's not going to dog it, she, playing them. No, cause, because she's a machine, because right. she just shoots, right. makes the balls, plays position. She's a machine, just look at her. So I'm op really optimistic I mean that, that I might see. Uh, I mean that kindly, Sammy. <laughs> <laughs> not a bad thing. Yeah, I'm really optimistic that I will see either Saming or, you know, a lot of these other young girls coming yeah, up absolutely. play at that top level. Because there's no reason why a female cannot play this game as well as a man. Not at all. And what's nice is they're proving it. Yes. And they always, all the, the men of our generation, my generation, said, well, you know, what, they'll never be able to do it because they don't, can't break as hard as we can. Well, excuse me. <laughs> Exactly I right. think uh, any top male would love to have this lady's break or Kelly Fisher's break. What a beautiful run. Yep. And straight in on the nine. 
And she likes to hit this one just nice. Yeah, nice good down speed. and always yep. control. Pull the cue ball back a little bit. Yep. You know, it's not a drawback, but it's always controlling the cue ball. She knows what she's doing. She knows how to play. Yep. Well, she needs three to take the title, and Kelly nope. needs nine. No, nope. five. Oh, that's right. They're going to 11. That's going right. 11. Okay, so this is mid-match, so there's still plenty of time. That's exactly right. I'm still, I'm still looking for the 10-10 final. Well, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime we're not in the, in the tournament, uh, we're, we're loving to watch a torturous match. Exactly. <laughs> If it's me, I want I want the eleven zero one me. <laughs> I've got one of those under my belt. Mm. I have a classic tour title. Uh, I defeated Brendan De Beard in eleven zero uh, in Detroit. That was the last tournament I won. Nice eleven zero. And I think it, the record. Well, no, that's right. It could be broken here today. Well, now I got to pull against her. Come on, Kelly. At least win one game. <laughs> I was just going to say it might, it'll never be broken because they don't go to 11 anymore, but they are. Boy, look at that break. And I mean, she, I'm watching her. She, she pulls back like, you know, the trigger pulls back and she just Let's goes go. right through. And it's not a full body. It's not like she jumps on, on the table. It doesn't do anything crazy, but that stroke arm, is, yep. that timing is right. just perfect. Yep. It's about timing. It is. It's not. It's it's controlled power and timing. I learned how to break break better. I'm breaking better than I ever broke in my life. I'm breaking good now. Uh, so am I, <laughs> and and I have to I have to thank a, a couple things, but but uh, people or whatever. But Jason Shaw was the one who told me. He said, "What are you doing?" And I said. What do you mean? And I, like he he said, you you rock back and forth. He goes, you put so much effort into the movement rather than hitting the ball. <laughs> he said, so yeah, yeah. so <laughs> yeah. So I stopped rocking. Yeah, and I followed through more on my, with my arm, mm -hmm. and it was so much simpler. Okay, she chose to push on that. Yeah, and that was a that was a smart smart shot. You know, pushing is a very difficult thing unless you can really push where you do not leave them, uh, you know, a shot or, um, and, and obviously Kelly gave this back because this is difficult. Home ball's in a tough spot. Well, that's why the old timers always say, you know, the push out rules, you know, for nine ball were so much better because push out is an art. It is. Knowing where to push and. Absolutely. Uh, yeah. And she's going to just try and soft roll this and see and that's why kelly gave it back because that is that was a very very difficult actually almost an impossible shot mm -hmm. to roll that that speed cut it make sure you don't double kiss the one ball right right that that's was right. a huge yeah, thing i think the, i think the one was frozen mm -hmm. yep and i think she'll just uh hit the right side of the ball right send it to the middle of the end rail and take the cue ball down mm -hmm. here to the end rail yep yep very good, good. shot Nice shot. She had a couple of two, two balls to hide behind. And how about this music, this tournament? I'm loving it. <laughs> this, the, the, I just, I, I told Melissa Little uh, that this tournament, I said, how sad that I know every <laughs> single word to every one of the well, songs. It, 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 you know, yeah, I agree, you know, but then, hey, at least it's music. Yeah, <laughs> At exactly. least you can understand the words. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know I'm dating myself, but yeah. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, these are the songs that we All played right. pool to. So now she's well, she must try be. And she's she's she can hit, but she has the edge of the, of the one ball. Yep. She's, she's going to hook her, try to hook her behind the five. Wow. What a great shot. <laughs> she hit it. Wow. What a great shot. Wow. And uh, she's she's determined not to give Kelly any air. You can't. Well, Again, we've we've already seen people come back from, you know, astronomical leads. Like I uh, said before, this is a rematch of last year's finals in the Asian Culture Day, and Kelly won the match. I don't think Simon does. And don't think she doesn't remember that. So <laughs> she's. Uh, Simon is like, yeah. 
I'm not giving you any air. Yeah, take some of this. <laughs> you know, giving someone air, I mean, it, it, they have to break and run out at this point. At this point, Kelly has to break and run out in order to have a shot at um, coming back. Okay, here we go. I think she has to... Uh, Two rails and one right two. on the nose. Yep. And she did. Wow. What a good shot. What a great shot. I mentioned and last uh, uh, match that I've seen an improvement mm -hmm. in her kicking. Yeah. And uh, I was sitting with Chris Melling, who, in my opinion, is, you know, one of the best, if not the best, uh, kicker in the game. And uh, he told me, yeah, he said, you know, with the accent, he says, yeah, we're, you know, Kelly and I are both from the same hometown in England. And I said, really? He says, yeah. He said, and I told her she needs to get her butt back home and spend a couple days with me on kicking. And uh, he said, she, you know, that's what cost her matches, you know, games, this tournament. And I think she did. I'm going to ask her if, uh, if she did go and spend some time with her because she seems to be kicking. Is she from Scotland she, or England? Well, she's living in Scotland okay. now, but she was born in England. Okay. And uh, she's living in Scotland. I think that's where Val, uh, Val's from. Val, yeah. Val Finney. Or she might be from Ireland. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Uh, you know, I <laughs> Sorry, have to guys. say, you know, we're typical <laughs> Americans. We're, we're just so insular. What an incredible cut shot. <laughs> Holy cow. Wow. Look at this girl. She, th that was, it. wow. And shape. She's in line. Wow. What, what can I say? Yeah. Wow. What a great shot. He played that, definitely. See if when she bends over, if we can get a look at it. Oh boy, she's got half a pocket. No, not going to be able to see it over her shoulder. I thought she had uh, shape. Well, she couldn't hit the one ball no, much she couldn't better. Hit any better. No. I mean, no. she sliced that thing right in. Okay, again, not wanting to give uh, Kelly any air. Not not taking. You, you know, it's funny. I mean, most people would not have shot that that one ball. A lot of people right, would exactly. not. Have, exactly. I wouldn't. Have. So so. If here, anything, here, I might have banked it. Mm -hmm. So here she's. She slices that in like it was nothing, and then the two ball, she doesn't. She doesn't want to give Kelly any air. Well, so, so Kelly unless can see she the thinks, full ball, and I think mm -hmm. Kelly's going to go for it. Bank shot, then draw. No, nope, safety. She's ducking. Yeah, she she's too good on those safeties too, though. Yeah. And that was a simple one. That was. Yep. Very, very good. good. See, this is the kind of match I'm I'm hoping to see. Exactly. Back and <laughs> forth. <laughs> yep, they're always the best ones. Sweaters, sweaters, delights. And, you know, to be honest with you, you know, I want to watch as much great pool as I can. Do you know how old Simon is by any chance? <sighs> She's uh, early 20s. Okay. I knew and I forgot. I was told okay. last year and I it's forgot. Okay. So somewhere in, the, somewhere in her 20s. Yeah, early 20s. Early can you imagine being able to play this well in your early 20s? Oh, boy, that's a very uncharacteristic miss. And she missed it because she... Had to spin the ball to change the she angle. Did. Yep. yep. Well, this is a huge opportunity for Kelly to get on the board. Absolutely, because again, you give someone a little bit of uh, uh, air, a little bit of a chance, and and they run out, and then you go, and then it goes from there. I think it's Kelly's break next, also. Mm-hmm. And she'll just want to bounce off the rail just to give herself a little angle, just like that. And this, uh, this will determine, this is the shot, this is the game ball as far as I'm concerned. She pockets this and gets good shape on the four ball, she should get out. See, she has a completely different, now remind you, she does play snooker, yes. but or comes from a snooker background, but remember, she's, she's also did very well. She also played the, the, the um, uh, what is it, uh, Chinese eight ball? Uh, yes, yeah. yes, 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 yes. So here's here's Chinese eight ball on a four and a half by nine table with Snooker netted, style pockets, with netted right. snooker pockets. Right. 
with these balls, right? Big balls. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, t talk about a difficult game. Right. So she has more of a pop stroke. It, she right. doesn't have a smooth stroke. It's right. not as smooth more as. More of a punch. As, mm -hmm. Yep. It's definitely, and and it's not. It's just a strong stroke. It's just there, there's there, it. They're totally different. I I can't even. Yeah, I find. Uh, if I had to compare my style to any of the players, I, I feel my game is very similar to Kelly's as far as the pocketing and the way she plays shape. Um, she doesn't let anything roll off very mm -mm. often. No, she's hitting the ball. Okay, on the board, six to one, making her move. And the fans like it. Well, of course. They don't want to go home either. They want to see a great match. And as we mentioned before, Kelly was born in England, but she's residing, residing in Scotland. And uh, she is sponsored by Zing Zhu Tables, Cyclop Balls, and been with Fury Cues for as long as I can remember. And uh, she's, uh, you know, a very accomplished player. She's a, definitely a future Hall of Famer as soon as she's el eligible, I think. Absolutely. She's a world nine ball champion, 10 ball US Open champion, won the tournament champ of champions four times. She's, uh, she's China Open and Cup. Definitely eligible. <laughs> you know, I mean, it just goes <laughs> on and on and on. And then, and that's just in pool. Mm -hmm. She was a six time snooker world champion before she even came over here. So she's a very accomplished uh, player. And she's fun to watch. I love watching there's her that, play. There's that big break. Yep. Okay, she's gonna get a look at the one. Four ball still spinning. Not a legal break. Wow. wow. So the one ball went oh. past the line. And that's the but only ball. The only ball, the other ones. The, the, as long as they cross she the made line a ball and come back. And she, the one ball went behind the line, but it was only two, and she needed three points. Wow. And this is just devastating. She had a great opening shot. Ugh. This is almost a routine rack. Exactly. You know, the only problem I see is uh, the seven to the eight. And very, you know, it's interesting. As as much as I thought the three points, she had a little out of line there. Um, as much as I thought that the three point rule after the break was going to be such a, um, I thought it was really not going to look good. <laughs> um, most people. Most people broke legally. Most yeah. people had the. It, it, it was not the as difficult. The first two days of the I tournament, I only saw. Now I'm talking about just stream matches because mm -hmm. those are the only matches I saw. I only saw it happen one time. Exactly. On Thursday so, and Friday, and then it, it, several yesterday, and uh, this is the second one today. So it, it's uh, it's been rare. Yeah, it is, and that's really rare for Kelly, who breaks them pretty. Uh, <laughs> Pretty, pretty uh, monstrously, yeah, you know. She's to, got to, to as big not, a break yeah, as anybody. Exactly, to, to not have that. Now, Saming did get out of line she did. on the two ball, but meanwhile, she's uh, recovered uh, somewhat. Somewhat. She's on a little Still funny. On the wrong side. A little funny of a bit of an angle because she's uh, she didn't want to be, she wanted to be straight or on the other side of the, uh, where she is on the three. Exactly. So she's going to just draw this ball back. Looks like she's using. Low right hand Low English. Right. Yeah, mm -hmm. Straighten out the ball. Yeah. Try to draw it back. She only has one pocket for the four. Unless she goes. Unless she goes. Is she going to go under, yeah. or is she going to go for the combination? She'll go for the combo. Well, I don't. I think she was looking to go under, and and yeah. she yeah she, she hit wanted the, to yeah. go under. Yeah. She did. No, now she's stuck playing the combination or the bank. The bank might clear. Let's see if we can take a look. I think the combination. Yeah, we really can't tell. Oh, I mean, went back Yeah, back. I think yeah, the combination's the easy combination. enough. I think it's easy enough to, to, to take a chance. At <laughs> well, as far as I'm concerned, the only easy combination is the nine was in the jaws. Is that, I, I, <laughs> I understand. But, but uh, it's, it's, it's easy enough to where I, I, I like her. Yeah, well, at her level, it... Uh, Unless she... I mean, it's going to say in the banking that, that, that would work. It. it would work if she banked it. She's, l oh, okay. Meanwhile, she look at this. Look at this. She got a little roll. A little roll. But at least uh, Kelly can pocket it. 
it's interesting she's not tangled up. being a spectator and watching she didn't state she wasn't committed to that as much as she was other shots you yeah. know and and she didn't like it no you can clearly you can clearly say it was like one of those where she hit it and hoped she <laughs> hoped it was going to go in yeah because she played safe with the cue ball mm -hmm. oh what a great shot yeah. meanwhile she got to come with another one she was hoping she to stay on that it. side yeah, yeah. Well, she tried to keep it on the side where the eight ball is very again very difficult on on everything is just playing a little bit fast this week yeah. so and you know how it is you know when you get behind yeah. everything's tough everything yeah i'm gonna say one you make you come with the shot you got to come with another shot and then she's hitting this with a hair inside mm -hmm. and she's going to come around two rails one two look at this <laughs> oh what a what a fabulous shot <laughs> there's not let Let's me see if tell we can you see that again please show that again because there is not um, yeah, i blew it again After all those beautiful shots she made, she hung the eight. Mm. Oh, she's got to be sick. No. 